And, I mean, there's just no shortage of patience from Salem's end at all. Rido as well. Salem but will drain and run that clock all the – whoa. Wait, that was just – But I thought the snaky snake was coming out, man. It is. Oh, it's not? Oh, well, it was, yeah, it was, I mean, it was – it was on the screen. I thought that's what it was. All right. Well, it looks like the hero himself. All right. Well, that's the uh, that's the one spell you want right off yeah, the bat. Yeah. Seriously. All right. That'll kind of neutralize a lot of those projectiles from Duck. Hunt. All right. Okay. All right. Okay. My man oh. got bounce and then kaboom. All right. This this dude's RNG is like off the roof right well, now. Well, Salem. You know what? Even when I was talking to him yesterday, I asked him why he didn't go hero versus Armada. He was like, he's not worthy of my RNG. I was like, boy. Damn. Was, I was like, boy, what, what? Who hurt you? Like, what? <laughs> he was really just going off, man. Here's the thing, you know, oh my! That's Wait, it? the can, and yeah, that's... Damn. Okay. Wow. Okay, yeah, I was kind of talking smack about that hero. But okay, I uh, you know what? You know what? I will say this. Hero's very good in zoner v zoner matchup. Because right now, against a setup character, Hero, you see Salem, Rido's giving him all the space in the world. So right now, Salem's retreating yep, and, and opening up the menu. He has plenty of time to go through his spells, yeah. And he's either going to bring out a powerful spell like Kaboom, or he's just going to buff himself. Right now, Salem's playing that support character. Yeah, he's, he's looking for bounce. He's looking for oomph, psych up. He wants all those buffs. Maybe even accelerate at that. Because if you just sit back and let Hero buff himself, he becomes a stronger character. Facts on facts. And maybe that maybe that was the strategy, right? The game plan. He knows how Rhino's going to play. He knows the benefits and strengths of that Heal? duck hunt. So it's just like, well, I'm going to take advantage of the fact that we're probably going to have a lot of space between us. Yeah, and right there, he just went to the platform, retreated, and Rhino is not now, willing to commit I, himself I also there. have another theory that might not be quite as nice. What's up? Can Rhino, can he read those those spells at the same level as Sam? Oh, Because that my. might, <laughs> when you think about it, that's kind of messed up. That's bro. grimy. <laughs> like, come on, dog. Like, Rhino, like, I've talked with Rhino. Rhino's English is definitely up there. Not not like Abba or uh, Ken status. Like, yeah. Abba and Ken have really good English. But, I mean, I, I've had conversations with Rhino. And I'm not trying to be funny. I was just bringing up, like, a, a you're legitimate absolutely, point. No, you're absolutely right. I feel like could be something to keep in mind. I mean, nonetheless, he's even the stocks up, but... As this as this set wanes on, it'll be interesting to see how how this uh, how Rido deals with this hero. Because there's a lot of people that are uh, multilingual, but they don't know how to read the language. Exactly, that's bro. a very common thing. Yeah. So that's, man, what, that's, that's what I was wondering. Yeah. Because <laughs> when I'm playing against hero, I'm looking at that menu when they bring it up because exactly. that's public knowledge. But it might not be so public knowledge here, man. Rido got to hit up that library. That man said, "You gonna play me? Better bring a Rosetta Stone with you." Dude, that's so mad. Dude, there's no way he knew that. He can't read it. There's no, I don't believe he can read it. You don't go right into a kaboom headstrong like that. Salem is an ass. Dude, <laughs> like, confirm. Dude, whatever it takes. Whatever it takes, man. Like, damn, oh bro. God. It's like that? Like, wow. That's that's messed up, dude. I, you, there should be a rule where you can counterpick the language. This is Team Petty if I've ever seen it, bro. <laughs> counterpick oh, language, no. dude. You know what's crazy? Everyone was talking about that in Twitter when Hero came out, right? But it was a meme. Like, we never thought we were actually well, going to see a, that be the case. Right. It was a meme, but, like, you know, some people were actually serious. Uh, yeah. Well, Salem was. <laughs> <laughs> Salem saw that on Twitter. He was like, actually. Wow, this is – oh, my Lord. Is he – Okay, okay, so <laughs> Hero's broken if your opponent can't read the menu, bro. Like that, that ain't right, dude. This is the grimy, like, yo, yo, Salem actually out here trying to look, trying to be the villain of Ultimate, bro. I, Didn't shake what? Armada's hand it's yesterday. Not. You saw, if you guys haven't seen that, um, Salem <laughs> defeated Armada, <laughs> and Armada went out for the handshake or the fist bump, and my man's was not about it. Turned his back, unplugged the controller, and walked away. Turned his back. Salem is, you know what? I like Salem because he marches to the beat of his own drum. Even if the he drum's is. not uh, quite on the standard. You know what I'm saying, man. Not quite the uh, the usual drum, but he beats to it for sure. That is something special. <laughs> and you know what, man? You are talking about earlier, you got to be yourself. You do. And Salem, you know, not a lot of people might agree with his uh, his ninja way, but he's about it, and he, he is solely being What did I say? At the end, at the end of the day, be true to yourself, be yourself, do what you do. You can sit at that lunch table alone, okay? But everybody else at the cafeteria gets served by Big Shirley, you're the one with the Postmates, the Uber Eats, okay? You're getting them ducats, Secure all right? the bag. That's it. It's all about the bag, man. And Salem's securing the, the bag. bag out here because he knows my man Rito can't read that menu. Oh. He is securing this bag as he's trying to secure this top eight spot at Summit because you already know if Salem, Salem was not at the last Summit. And Armada and Levin were there. If my man Salem. If he doesn't qualify, he's not getting it. Oh, <laughs> he's in, he's my in man a lot of trouble. 
Salem definitely not getting voted in. in so a, yeah, he is lot. definitely trying to secure it right here. He's in a lot of trouble. He understands that. All right, well, let's get it, man. This so, is just, the right look tight, bro. This is <laughs> really good. I wonder who won between Light and Schroeder as well. We'll find that out a little bit later. But nonetheless, here we are. Game number two. All right, and. <laughs> Man, this is gonna be rough. This for might Rido. be what Rido needs to do. Okay. Like, just just keep the pressure on. Like, be in his space. He has to be space. aggressive. He can't let Salem set up with all these these spells. Yeah, there we go. Rido coming in with these hitboxes. Enough of the can setups. Enough of the gunman setups. You need to rush this man down because yep. you can't even read the menu. Yeah, you don't even know what he's cooking. Yeah, exactly. He's I mean, he's plotting right in front of you, and you just don't see it. And that's scary because the, a lot of these spells are very easily avoided if you know what spell's coming because you can see which one they're hovering too. Ooh, okay, I like this pressure that we're seeing from Raito. Forced out the air dodge and an easy connection on the up air. Great efficiency so far from Raito. Oh, oh yep. I, and okay. I, <laughs> my man Raito literally up aired this guy like 15 times. I don't know. <laughs> that stock was just up airs. <laughs> Raito stinks so far back. He doesn't know what kind of... Wow. 42% and Salem getting really desperate with that full charge neutral beat. It takes a lot of mana as well. Okay, up B out of shield is frame 10, fairly quick. Uh, oh, there's the bounce. Oh, man, he just walked right up to the cannon and just bounced it. That's that's funny, actually. I mean, attempted to grab him afterwards, just didn't quite have the range. Oh, but oh, that, well, uh, <laughs> that'll always come through at the clutch. Especially with the psych up as well. Yeah. We're going to make that next swing uh, more powerful there. Now we got the oomph online as well. And, man, this mana looking kind of low on uh, on Salem. And that that's the unique thing about Hero, right? Uh, a JRP or... Japanese RPG game, and it was really cool how Sakurai implemented the uh, the menu and the mana as well as a resource for nobody could this make character. Nobody could make better moves than Sakurai. This man He's so good. is a genius. Yes, he is so good at just bringing the characters from different games and really making them feel like they're part of Smash. Yeah. Like they're, they're a Smash character, but they're still very unique in a sense that they're from that game. Yeah, they stay true to kind of their roots, and that's what I really appreciate. And obviously, Salem staying true to his roots, uh, just <laughs> this hero pick. Dude, that, look at that bounce. It did work because yeah. Can comes out frame one, so that's going to be an autopilot thing that Duck Hunts are going to do. Oh, I'm getting beat up. That's not something you can just break out of. That's not a habit that's easily break. Right. You know what it's, I'm saying? It's like, even like Snake. Snake is going to do that too. But the thing about Duck Hunt is when he does his frame one Can, he's shooting it out. Snake pulls it and like holds it to him. So that, that wouldn't get bounced. Okay. Right. Now, Raido keeping it close, but honestly, for the lead that he had in the beginning, you know, Hero or... Salem has done a really good job bringing this one back. Yeah, not at all. I mean, you know, it, it's kind of one of those things. You kind of, you almost expected it to a certain extent. But I do like the fact that Rido at least has elected to be a lot more aggressive in certain yes, spots. Yes, yes. And I, it's paying off for him tenfold here. Even the stage pick doing oh, a really man, good job. Up, those up airs were so crucial getting that first stock off. And yet again, you see him aiding him extremely well. Oh, yeah, and especially with this tri-platform layout, Raido is forcing Salem into these uncomfortable positions where he can, you know, seek out these up airs, even frame trap him. I, we've seen him frame trap with the can, throw out the can, trap him and make him do some kind of panic option or air dodge, and then he secures that up yep. air. But, man, just like that, Salem's going to secure that second stock. But look at that accelerate. Look at that movement. Even when, when Hero is buffed up, he is... One hell of a character. Oh, man. absolutely. And that's, you know, honestly, that's what Salem goes for a lot of times. Like, he's content, to, you know, when he can put that space between his sift through those spells, he goes for the best ones. I mean, again, a character based on RNG, but if you know what you're going for, it makes life a lot easier. And there are. Rido, I'm not sure he knows what he's, exactly what he's pulling all the time, but nonetheless, he's found a way to kind of deal with it and uh, make this a very respectable game. Okay, but right here on the ledge trap, going for the up B. Wow, that does cover quite a yeah. lot. So, actually, really smart. Oh, wow, I've never seen this before. Okay, yeah, yeah, I've seen it, it a couple times, but it's working. I mean, phenomenal. Yeah, seriously. And Hero is definitely one of those characters where your advantage state is, like, very good. Like, very, very, very good. Um, so, because you can set up with spells and set up with, like, preemptive stuff like that. I'm trying to catch him with that, uh, with the black ball of death. <laughs> the thwack and whack are always very <laughs> hilarious. I don't know if Ryder's going to be laughing at the moment. This is probably a little too close for comfort in his eyes. Oh, yeah. Especially considering the lead he had. But Salem's got to get off these platforms. He does not want to get up aired. Because yeah, that's, that's been the key to victory exactly, here. Exactly, bro. The easy go-to for Rido. And Salem knows it. Oh, wow. Okay. It gets an opportunity. Kind of gets a jail, get out of jail free oh, card. Grab the wrong way, though. Rido the one that gets a grab out. And, oh, th that stage two of the uh, the side B is so good. Probably uh, his best spell. And there's oh, the they, bounce. It couldn't have come at a better time either. I, down, wow. game, like down to the wire, final and stop. And psych up. Oh, my 
my goodness. Yeah, what is he going to do, man. bro? I want to see him get a grab. I think yeah, uh, he grab might actually. Yeah, yeah I think <laughs> grab will probably kill. Oh, the up air. We living? Still yes, not enough, are. though. He's still got the psych up. Oh, another grab from Raido. Can he make it back, though? Eh, great directional air dodge. Ooh, get up attack. Everybody gets one. <laughs> right. Okay, what spell is he going to look for next? Kind of looking a little low on the mana here. 34 <gasps> mana. And the stage two. Is that it? That kill? Yes, it is. Bruh, stage two, stock three. Man. The place to be. Salem going up 2-0 over Raido. Man, I know Salem's the villain, but he rocking this hero pretty well. This is crazy, bro. Damn. This, this, and the, the fact that he was the one coming back. And you know what? I, I was talking to Salem the other day about hero, and he had some pretty solid points. You know, obviously the character's RNG, but there are ways to nullify or make your RNG more in your odds. So if you have bounce up, you not, can't, you're not going to get it again. You can't get bounce yeah. on the menu. Yeah, exactly. So once he, like, he'll even put bounce up in... Um, in matchups where they have no projectiles, just so he has better chance to get other spells. Yep, you only out. get two heals per stock, and the only time you get your heals refreshed. Whoa. Uh oh. 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 Okay. Can I? Can I get my boy Banjo on the he, screen? I guess he decided I'm gonna match you DLC for DLC. Oh no! I hate when you do that. Um, right there, you want to do a reverse down beat. Yeah. So he just actually wasted a Wonder Wing, and those, really, those are just so crucial. I mean. Yes. Very, very crucial. Even in on the offense, on the defense as well. Um, uh, Banjo's recovery is very good if you have Wonder Wing. Yeah. If you don't have Wonder Wing, that recovery it can is. Can be a little more susceptible. That's yes. Fair. Yes. Fair. Definitely not as much mix-ups. Oh, huh? there's the snooze. But I, I already know. Oh, there's the kaboom, and again, not being able to read <laughs> that menu is not good. <laughs> And I, I love the sounds Banjo make, man. It's just like so like according to his game. <laughs> yeah, I mean, he's, again, he stays true to. <laughs> yeah, yeah, for sure. And I mean, this is another zoner matchup. And you already know, man, Raido is someone that loves to play those goofy zoners. Oh, oh. and there's the Wonder Wing. What a call out from Raido. Seriously, man, using it to its full capabilities. Those are those plays. You oh, my God, Salem, though. Jeez, I don't, what was that, down smash? Yeah, it's, he just, I mean, the. What a call out. Uh, exactly, bro. The fact that he just went for that, like no hesitation. I mean, Raido didn't even get an opportunity to really enjoy a lead. Yeah, and I like. just retaliated so quickly. I like that he went for down smash too because it was gonna, it will cover both sides too, right? If he went for the roll just, or the swing. Just charged it like. Ooh, here's the jab coming out from Banjo. And you know what? Even um, when Banjo did come out and I saw his kit, I already like low-key knew that, I mean, he, if Tweak stayed Banjo, he probably would have been the best Banjo, but I, I don't know if Tweak's going to keep on with Banjo. But Raido for sure is going to be one of the best Banjos in the world. I can see just that. because he's so similar to Duck Hunt. Or not like super similar, but he's just that, that goofy zoner. You yeah, know, yeah. That, that archetype. It, it's so a very, he's a very unique character. A lot of unique tools that, uh, to use and, you know, really for your opponent to have to deal with. Well, there's a Wonder Wing going high, but the stage two side B will cover that. And you just see Raido using all his resources, the reverse grenade, these, uh, these neutral B eggs as well. They're so good, and I love the those those neutral B is really slept on as a move. It it has a lot of hit stun, and after its a f initial launch, it actually like bounces very slow. So it's a very good setup tool. Oh my goodness! So there's a good coverage tool. Wonder Wing again, gonna remove another stock from Salem. So definitely, uh, you're seeing Rido's efficiency with being able to connect that. Oh yeah, I mean if, if you're able to connect Wonder Wings this accurately, Banjo is gonna look busted. Like I'll, I'll be straight up, you know what I mean? Because Wonder Wing is that high risk, high reward because it's a very laggy move. Nice, Just held his ground up till easy clear out. And like you said, once again, Salem not really letting uh, Rido enjoy his lead. Yep. You know, not just like coming right back off the Angel platform, not skipping a beat and just getting that stock. Ooh, Man, actually this, took this the grenade into his own hands. Oh, I love that follow up. Yeah. And the thing about Wonder Wing, you don't get the armor before the hit. Yeah, so, so you, can, you're still, you can get punished out of that. Like right. That if you do get hit before it comes out, though, um, you do get your uh, feather refunded. So it doesn't burn a feather. But it comes out frame 18. The armor and the hitbox comes out frame 18 at the same time. Uh, might be looking for a refund on this stock. Oh, no, the what? dash attack? Uh, yeah, he was, he was souped up. I mean, he was souped up for it. The link dash attack, man. And it, that's hard to hit, but I like how Salem uses it as an anti-air. Usually you see people like kind of commit to yeah, people yeah. in the corner on the ground to hit them on the ground, but right there Salem used it as an anti-air and I just phenomenal comes. coverage. Yeah, that was and really I, good. I really have to say, you know what? I, I was downplaying Hero in the beginning of this, but I, I feel like Hero definitely has a place in the meta in terms of counterpick because he knew he was going up against a player and a player that plays a zoner. 
No matter what, I, I've never seen Raido play like this rushdown character. No, I he do loves that. the zoners, right? Like he, he can get aggressive with the duck hunt, but at the end of the day, it's still still zoning, so, right? Yeah. So, I mean, he's gonna go for hero, and if if any zoner setup character, there they have it, it takes time to zone or set up these traps. So you know, Sam was like, "Let me hit you with the menu, man. <laughs> let, me, let me let me think. Let me get that uh." Yeah, bounce though. Yes. Yeah, there was a, there was definitely a multiple factors on why Salem elected to bring out the hero. But hey, you know what? One thing I will say for him, he he said that this character has a lot of potential. He's going to master. I'll tell you what, these last couple of weeks when I've seen him play, he's been looking up. Yeah. Things have been looking real up for him. So big ups to him taking out Rhino three zero at that, uh, forcing the banjo to come out game three, and it just was not enough. It, too much bounces. I, I feel like uh, you know every t I feel like banjos like. In certain matchups, you can't be too tunneled vision on the grenade. Um, I've been playing a lot of banjo myself, and it just, it, there's just certain matchups where you, like, you can't let them set up like that. Because right there, Salem was just setting up all his buffs. Yeah. You can't let that happen. So you sometimes you have to play that rushdown with banjo. And banjo does have the run speed to do it. Obviously, he doesn't have like crazy good like dash attacks. He can tilts, move, though. Like but he can definitely move. He has a decent dash attack that... like. Combos at low percent, forward tilt, frame seven, pretty good disjoint. Like you can get up in personal. And the fact that of the matter is he has the run speed to do it. Like Banjo's quick. For like a zoning character, he can move on the ground. If you are played fast. his games, you know Banjo's quick. That boy, that boy, that big boy, big boy be moving. Oh yeah. Especially when you go into like the the initial like the the run animation with Kazooie that's doing the running. That's when Banjo is really going. Like Kazooie can move. Kazooie.